I don't know if you watched the new Axe deodorant commercial, but it has a lot of subliminal messages. You gotta try this new Axe. It's the fine fragrance goat. The finest fragrances with the goat. Now take a look at the beginning of this commercial. Notice right away they are featuring the image of Baphomet. And they are portraying the rapper Lil Baby as having four hands. And in each hand, he is holding a can of Axe deodorant. Since they are featuring the goat, which is Baphomet, I'm going to place them on the screen. Now it's about to get very interesting. Notice that Lil Baby and Baphomet hands are in the same position. The only difference is Lil Baby is portrayed as having four hands. Now I'm going to put an arrow next to this hand and this hand and next to Baphomet hands. Notice they are in the same position. Even when I switch hands, they are both holding a hand up and a hand down. This hand position represents a common occultic phrase that means as above, so below, which refers to divination or channeling spirits. I guarantee you, they don't want you to see this part. They are trying to plant something corrupt in your subconscious without you being aware of it. That's the intentions of a subliminal message. That's why they call the shows on TV programs, because the ideal is to program your mind to think the way they want you to think. So they'll show you these occultic images and make them appear harmless to desensitize your mind from being able to perceive the true intent behind their agenda. Now, there's another scene where they are promoting the all-seeing eye, but they don't make it as obvious. Take a look at this. Notice that the object came out of one of this alien-like creature eye socket. That alludes to the all-seeing eye. Sometimes they'll put a hand over the eye, an object over the eye. However, in this case, they have an object coming out of one eye. Listen, these people are too smart and educated to make a mistake like this. What I'm trying to say is they know exactly what they are doing. And let me say this. If something is rooted in the demonic, by changing the name does not change what it represents. For example, if I had a Coca-Cola and placed the Sprite label on the can, it does not change the fact that it's still a Coca-Cola. So don't be deceived when they use terms like greatest of all times when they promoting Baphomet. And so brothers and sisters, put on the whole armor of God that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. God bless you.